Now, ladies and gentlemen, if you want to follow me, I will show you our latest experiment, the American Sophomore. Let's go. Alright, stay quiet. There he wow, is. that's so that's cool. Amazing. Holy cow. Now, what we have gathered from the American Sophomore is they tend to live fairly normal lives, but watch this. Hey buddy! Hey! Hey! Who wants a jewel? Gimme, give gimme! Give <gasps> Who wants a jewel? Please, gimme! Who wants a jewel? Gimme! Give give Who wants a jewel? Gimme! Ready? Ready? Catch! <laughs> See, and immediately, he's attracted to the jewel, and, and he, he vapes. He vapes. Come on! Oh, yeah. Yes! Now, before I take questions, we have tried telling him but it seems that the American sophomore is completely oblivious to the fact that vaping is gay. Wow, I have a question. Uh, question. Uh, question. Uh, I have a question. Uh, have you tried explaining to the American sophomore that, well, vaping is gay? Yes, we have tried explaining to the American sophomore that vaping is gay, but the only response we can get out of them is, um, hear me, it says, bro, you know, and I quote, bro, no, it's not. Try some. Oh, I have a question. Me, me, oh, I have a question. Me, me, me. Uh, what would you recommend a mother of American sophomore, a friend, or a loved one do if, like, knowing that vaping is gay, what should they do to the American sophomore that doesn't realize that vaping is gay? Well, from the, from the research we've gathered, we feel that the best thing to do in these types of scenarios is, you know, laugh at your kid, you know, harass the kid, Make fun of him, just bully him overall, because uh, we feel maybe if we squash his morality enough, he will go into a depression and we won't have to deal with him anymore. Keeps getting foggier outside. Scarier and scarier by the minute. God.